Welcome to Bunny Love TV. Keisha Cole's mother reveals shocking details about the singer's father in a very emotional interview. Let's talk about this story, you guys. It's been years since the backlash, but I remember belter Keisha Cole certainly hasn't forgotten when fans and detractors alike slammed her for statements they perceived as denouncement of her blackness. Back in 2012, the Grammy nominee revealed she was biracial in response to a question regarding why black girls rock. When the negative commentary about her revelation heated up, Cole responded. Black girls rock. Off I feel all girls rock. And by the way, I don't know what I mixed with, nor have I tried to find out. She took to Twitter to say, I was raised in Oakland. My mother is black. However, I do not know my father. Fast forward to 2019. The R&B diva took to her Fox Soul talk show one-on-one -on -one with Keisha Cole to sit down with her mother, Frankie Lawns, for an in-depth interview to address her racial makeup, details about her father, and more. The conversation took an emotional turn when Lawns revealed shocking detail about her relationship with Cole's dad. After the 2012 backlash from her statement of being biracial, Cole went on the hunt herself to find and announce in 2016 that her father was high-profile boxing trainer Virgil Hunter, an African-American. Frankie clarifies in the interview that Hunter is not Keisha's father. Instead, Frankie says Cole's dad is an Italian-American man who is now deceased claiming to have met him when she was a prostitute. Frankie reveals the man was significantly older than her. Well, let me just jump in here and say real quick that I do believe Frankie. I think Frankie's telling the truth. Frankie may not have told the truth in um, many cases. I mean, well, according to the show, uh, well, all of the reality shows that Keisha Cole has had, um, you could just kind of tell that there was some things not really clear with Frankie and Keisha and that whole adoption situation, all of that. So Frankie may not have always been honest about everything, but this right here, I think Frankie's telling the truth. Um, you can't always go by how somebody looks and this may sound odd, but I'm just giving my opinion. Okay. Keisha Cole does look like she may be biracial, just her features, her skin tone. Um, it doesn't necessarily mean that she is, but she does look like she is, um, like she's biracial. She does. Um, and Frankie was out there. Frankie was on drugs. Frankie admitted that she was a prostitute. She would prostitute to get the drugs. And I do believe that Keisha Cole was a product of some of the things that she did out there in the street when she was out there prostituting herself. It's quite possible. Frankie probably never would have dreamed in a million years that some of the things that she was doing out there in the street in order to get her next fix would produce a famous daughter. She probably never thought that. Um, if she had even imagined um, anything of, of the sort, I'm sure she probably would have done everything in her power to keep um, in touch with that man or to keep some type of way to um, have those two connected before he, he passed away. If her story is valid, which I believe that it is. I do believe Frankie is being honest on this one. I think that, yes, Keisha Cole was just a product of some of the things she was doing out there in the street. She openly admits that she has seven children by seven different men. Um, she admits that she was on drugs and she admits that she was a prostitute. Most people wouldn't admit these things, but she's open and honest about these things. And you cannot fault her for that. Most people that live that type of life in the past they are ashamed to talk about things like that, ashamed to admit, ashamed to be real about how they were living. But Frankie was honest about the fact that she was an addict and she prostituted herself to get the drugs. And she talked about it on national television, on Keisha Cole's reality shows. So because she was open and honest about that, um, 
I don't see why she wouldn't be open and honest about this. She knows who she slept with. She knows who her father is. Um, with her being a prostitute out there, some would say, oh, well, how would she know if she slept with, you know, a whole lot of men to get the drugs? Um, you could question that. Yes, I, I could see how that could be a question. However, um, I'm sure her memory is not bad either. I'm, I'm sure she remembers, duh, who she slept with. And Keisha Cole definitely does have strong biracial features. That's just my opinion on the matter. I'm not saying that Keisha Cole's mom, Frankie, what she's saying is, you know, like etched in stone and it's the absolute truth. I don't know. None of us know. Um, only people that know are the two that came together and conceived Keisha, the father may not know, but the mother definitely knows. Um, but all we have to go by is, you know, what she says and um, what we believe. And I believe Frankie. I, I think she's telling the truth on this one. Um, so you guys, all right, uh, that's my time. I'm going to go ahead and go drop your comments. Let me know what you think. I'm hoping that Keisha Cole is at peace with all of this information that has been tossed around about her father and who he could be or who he possibly is or who he is. Um, because that's got to be one hell of a, an emotional thing to deal with, not to know who your father is or to be sure that's gotta be hard. Hopefully she's taking this well. Um, hopefully she's at peace with the, um, well, she came out and said, Virgil Hunter was her dad back in 2016. Maybe she's at peace with that, even though Frankie says otherwise. Hopefully she's at peace wherever, you know, whatever the situation is with her dad. You know, she, she's feeling, you know, good about it because that's that's a very hard thing to kind of deal with. Um, I wouldn't know. I've always had my dad. So the, and I, I could I could just imagine not having him. So that's why I say that's got to be hard to deal with. All right, you guys, uh, follow me on all social media platforms into the video. We'll have just where you can find me. Uh, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, uh, YouTube here, of course, subscribe if you haven't. And join me yet again. I'm always celebrity blogging. So celebrity gossip talk, celebrity news flash, reality show reviews and current news right here. Check me out again and have a great day, you guys. It's all love. Don't forget to add the underscore when adding me on Instagram.